Hey guys, Corey here. The Digital Nerd Advocates are honored to be a part of Phoenix Overdrive's Extra Life team. Put your money where the miracles are. You can be a hero to the kids of Children's Miracle Network as fundraising for Extra Life continues through December 31st, 2016. National Game Day has been announced and will take place on November 5th, 2016. I will be joining Lee, Ray, and Becky of Nerd Overdrive, as well as others, in upstate New York to help celebrate and raise money for Children's Miracle Network hospitals. Remember that you do not need to select Phoenix Overdrive's primary hospital to raise money for. You can raise money for your local Children's Miracle Network hospital, wherever that may be. It's for the kids. Check out digitalnerdadvocates.com slash pawnextralife for more details, as well as links to the Extra Life team page and the Uncharted, the Nathan Drake Collection PS4 bundle raffle information. <sighs> All right, topic three, speaking of favorite games. You're not asking me my favorite game, are you? I am. Hashtag, oh, hashtag seven fave games. Seven? seven? Uh, yeah. What? Yeah. I cut that back. Yeah. Seven. Nah, dude. Seven fave games. We're just going to go down the list and maybe talk about two or three of them. Okay. I don't have mine listed. I don't have a list yet. I, I mean, mine aren't in any particular order. You should, you should just probably go first then. Mm. Okay. Gears of War 2. Okay. I remember, dude, we played so much Gears of War 1 that when Gears 2 came out, remember when we pulled the all-nighter? That was Gears, Gears War 3. We, I, mean, I think we did it for all three of them, though. Well, not the first one, because... But I know for two and three we did. Yeah. I remember specifically for three because I had, the next day I had my test for my bonnet for my license. Yeah. And instead of, like, studying for it, I stayed up and played like Gears, Gears three. Of War 3 yeah. all freaking night. <laughs> I still passed. Nice. <laughs> uh, Halo 3. I didn't expect to think Halo 3 would have a big impact, but it. I played a lot of Halo 3 even though I wasn't, like, a huge Halo 2 fan. Like, because we didn't have broadband internet at the time. When Halo 2 came out, so I didn't really get to play a lot of multiplayer. Uh, Mario Kart Double Dash. Took my GameCube to college in the dorm room. It was a big hit. Smash Brothers and Double Dash. Double Dash more than Smash Melee, surprisingly. It was awesome. It was always a rush to get to the Paratroopa because that was the only character that could use red shells. And then the people that got stuck with Donkey Kong had the giant banana. They're like, fuck, fuck. My friend always used um, Koopa Kid. Because he had the giant shell, but was still a small character. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, Destiny made my list. I don't remember a game that's like... I think of that. Yeah, that makes sense. I, there's never been a game like Destiny that's kept me coming back yeah. to it. Even after I get bored of it, I still come back like a month later, two months later to check out what's new or what's happening or lack of what's happening. Uh, and now we're obviously all excited for Rise of Iron. Very. Um you're going to make fun of me for this. If it's Twilight Princess, it you is. need to take that shit off. Legend right of Zelda, now. Twilight Princess, the GameCube version. I uh, love that game. I just I just love that game. Brian, I'm going to about to redeem myself. I know. I, I, I can't see your list, but I'm reading your mind. And if this is a Super Nintendo game? TMNT, Turtles in Time for Super Nintendo. One of the best co-op experiences of, of our lives that game. Yeah. How many hours do you think we poured into that game? How many hours do you think... Turtles in Time or Destiny, what do you have more time More time in? For you and me? Yeah. Like, for us playing together. Probably Destiny, to be honest with you, but I'd like to say Turtles in Time. I mean, it's Re- close. Realistically... Yeah, realistically. I hate to burst that bubble, because, like, but it's, you know, you can't, you, <sighs> once you beat Turtles, like, we were usually done the night, we, we beat it, and we played something else. I know, but it was still. We, we played it literally every time when, because we Every time kids. we got, every time we got together when we were every kids, we the first out, game we played we, was Turtles in Time. We like, all right, well, let's just beat Turtles in Time really quick, on yeah. the hardest difficulty, and yeah. then we'll play something else. Yeah, yeah. And we always and had to change, change it to comic mode, because it made the yeah. Turtles, like, cool. Yeah. yeah. And then, uh, Final yeah, Fantasy, Angela, Final Fantasy Nine. Over 10. Those Roman uh, numerals are backwards. No, they're not. That's Don't 11. Worry. Don't worry about it, Joey. <laughs> they can't <laughs> He's see. He's reading the list, not you. They can't see yeah, that I made a mistake. No, 9 was an excellent game. If I had to pick one of my favorite Final Fantasies, that's probably up yeah. there. It's yeah. close. Yeah, so that's my hashtag fit, 7 fave games. Oh, 7. I've come up with like 5 now, I think. Diablo, Final Fantasy 14, 
Okay, Final Fantasy, yeah, probably. Blood just because I spent. Blood yeah, Souls. Dark. Okay, no. <laughs> do, you <laughs> just, do, do you just want us to do the list for you? I mean, Final <laughs> Exile, I don't know. No, I mean it's an, it's a fun game, and it's probably eventually. Well, I wouldn't consider it now because I've only been playing. I'm it sure, for Baldur's a Gate Dark Alliance is in there somewhere. No, uh, I don't think I ever played that one actually. Uh, All right, I'm gonna have to go. We'll go with an Elder Scrolls game. We'll go with Morrowind. I think was my favorite out of the three I've played. That's understandable. A lot of people like that game. That was, yeah. That's Morrowind a very underrated very, 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 very. Which was, there's a mod on Skyrim for PC that well, it's all the, modern. The, the edition they're coming out with is going to have mods. Yeah. So we'll see. I don't know which ones are going to have. I mean, Skyrim already has mods on the PC. I know. They're going to have it for the console. Okay. I'm about to smack that <laughs> right off your head. Um, so, Morrowind. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have to go. See, the only Metroid Prime game I've played was three, but no, I'm gonna go with with Zero Mission for the Game Ooh, Boy good Advance. Choice. That that game, like, cause like I gotta include a Metroid game in there. It was very close. I had to cut Super Metroid. Uh, it was close. There's a game that there's a couple games that are missing off your list that I'm gonna put on mine. I'm interested to hear Borderlands this. One. I love the yeah. first, first. I have to applaud that game. choice because that, that 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 really is such a great game that doesn't get a lot of. No, because I mean everyone. Get, everyone talks everyone, about Borderlands too. Everyone, I mean the people who played lo- one oh, loved man, one. It was good. And that's it. When I played two, it was just a lot of the same thing again, just with cooler guns, I guess. Yeah, two so was all right, but it, yeah, it didn't. It didn't. I didn't have the same wow factor I did when I yes, played one. I agree. I am gonna have to include Diablo two. I was going to say, because I wouldn't say 3 was probably one of my favorite games, but it is fun. 2 is better. 2 is, yeah, by far better, I think. I agree. Even though now, I mean, it doesn't necessarily hold up completely, but it's still, yeah, it's how old now? 20 years old? Uh, Skies of Arcadia is by far my favorite JRPG I've ever played. Was that set? That felt like 7. Oh, he's counting them? Yeah, seven. that's 5 so far. Super Smash Brothers Melee for the GameCube it was by far my favorite Smash game. That was a good one. Oh, okay. it's a good. Not one. a huge Smash guy, but yeah, Wii U one's pretty good though. Not that anybody plays Wii U, but that, have, that game's pretty. I good. I had it for the DS because there's never Wii, but a Wii U. I mean, Mario Kart Eight is also very good. On oh, it's Wii. fantastic. But it's not good. I would argue that that's better than Double Dash, but Double Dash I just there's, it was at a point. There's a special meaning. Right there's there. a time and place where yeah. like that. Well, that game is for a lot of games. Like mm-hmm. they might not be. They might not hold up on the top 100 list, but yeah, I don't know what the last one is. We'll just throw something. Uh, Destiny. There's yeah, a, we'll there's a game we'll on there Destiny. I just thought of that I wish would have oh. been on my list, but I'll we'll throw on Destiny. I, 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 I might know it. I, I guarantee it's on your list. Knights of the Old Republic. Yeah, that's that's one. That wasn't oh, the Mass game. Effect. Actually, I'm gonna say Mass Effect. Mass Effect Two. Mass Effect Two. So good. Over Destiny. All right. All right. Mass Effect Two. Destiny. Skyrim. Uh, if 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 I was this isn't an order. If it was an order, Skyrim would be either two or one. Yeah. Um. How many is that? It's three already? Yeah. yeah. S- SOCOM 3? You you play a lot of SOCOM. Uh, we were very... We, we had a clan. We My buddies came over every weekend almost, and we played, remember, and we were very good. <laughs> remember when I came over, and, like, I didn't have SOCOM? So, like, I would just play my own games, but I'd hang out with you. And then that one time, Wenzel didn't come over, but left his PS2 at and your you house, and play. I got to play. Yeah. It was so much fun. We but were, I sucked real bad. Like, the only game I could, like, quick snipe in ever. Brian yelled at me even back then. <laughs> yeah. You know, if you're going to come play, you got to step it up. We won anyways. We I won know. all the time. I know. Um, so, wait, like, what I said. So, yeah. The first Knights of the Republic, Skyrim, um, Mass Effect 2, one of the best of all time. SOCOM 3 was great. Turtles in Time. Fantastic. Um, Ocarina of Time, still one of my favorites. I think that's six. For the it last beats one. Twilight Princess? Into the, into the, into the, the ground. Twilight Princess is so good. Best Zelda dungeons in any game. And I don't know, man. What I've played from Majora's Mask, I think Majora's Mask is better than Twilight Princess. Last one. It's up there. Majora's Mask is probably my second favorite Zelda game. I don't know. I guess Des. I mean, you guys have already said Destiny. That's such an easy answer. Um, Do you think Destiny is just one of those things that's kind of like in the moment? Do you no. think like ten years from now when we have this same discussion? I'm going to remember Destiny for, like how I remember SoCom. Like 
because the same with SOCOM, like I, I don't touch it anymore, but I have so many memories of that game and playing it like so much and how much fun I had with that game. Right. That I still remember it. And Destiny is the closest thing I found to it where like I play it as much and enjoy it and you know the raids and all that stuff um and i actually have to say for my last one probably is actually modern warfare 4 uh i love that game. modern warfare 4 <laughs> call of duty call 4. of duty modern warfare <laughs> brian's living in the future guys <laughs> modern warfare 4 is there not four no there's three <laughs> because then they, did then, they did, then they did ghosts and what about advanced warfare i'm sorry that was modern warfare slash modern warfare 2 i like both of those modern warfare 2 is good I like uh, in that case, you might as well just put Mass Effect Trilogy on there. Well, I mean, Mass Effect. I'm surprised 2, you didn't. Mass pick, Effect Two for me was like way better than the other ones. I'm like, surprised you didn't pick like Dead Space. Dead Space. I, was fun. You know, I didn't like get, have time to like write these down. Yeah, I know. You I, gave us like you know five minutes. You, to you about told this. me about. I it. gave you these notes yesterday. I know, but but then you're like, oh, we're supposed <laughs> to come up with them all off the top of your head, so I didn't write it down or think about it. Obviously, you lied. And you're like, oh, we're just. Gonna I just it. type mine out during the show. Oh uh, well. I, and I missed a couple. I don't read. Mass Effect 2 was I'm one. I'm like, wait, like our top seven games? Yeah, just off the top of your head. Okay, so I thought we were, so that was off the top of my head. No, I mean, Dead Space is good. I don't know. It's not in my top seven, though. Not yeah. of all the Dead Space games, Dead Space 1. Dead Space 1. Yes. Yeah. Like, the, the, the very first Modern Warfare, that one is... Yeah. Which is why I'm so pit. I'm not. I mean, that's that put Call of Duty on the map. That put it on the map because the other ones weren't really Especially great. Especially on consoles. Uh, that was like when my because that was the next gen game or not? Well, not next gen, but at the time it was like first one that I really played a lot of. Like, I mean, it it, it revolutionized multiplayer the way that Halo did on the original Xbox. Yes. Yeah. But for 360, and well, kind of I mean everything. I think it was right for PlayStation too. I think everything else aped it. You know what? No. I actually take both those off, and I'm gonna say the first Black Ops. I played the shit out of that one. Black Ops, Black Ops one was amazing. Yeah, that's that's the one I'm talking about. I played yeah. a lot of that. One. Black Ops I mean, two wasn't know, so not, fun on Wii U. I was just say Call of Duty. <laughs> Why did you get it for Wii U? <laughs> just Call of Duty in general. Because even the bad ones. Because it came out. They called it Black Ops two came out the year that the Wii U came out, and I bought everything on Wii U because I bought Wii U at launch. <laughs> I bought Assassin's Creed three for Wii U. <laughs> About Black That's Ops a game I never Wii went U. back and played. I have Assassin's Creed 3. I have Assassin's uh, Creed 4. I bought Darksiders 2 for Wii U. I bought Mass Effect 3 for Wii U. You're hey, Ma- weird. Mass Effect 2 is... Mass Effect like- 3 on Wii U is a definitive way to play that version, except for the fact that you don't have the other two games, which really sucks. Because I don't know if I can agree with you on that. No, that. like... Just hear me out. No. Okay. No. No. The no. touchpad allows you to... What's the next topic? ...give commands on the fly... Oh, it's it's time for community mail. <laughs> <laughs> Brian just doesn't want to talk about Nintendo guys. Mario Super Mario Run is coming to iOS in December. I did have a game that was on the Super Nintendo on my list. It was the same one that you had. Turtles in Time. That's not a Nintendo Super, game. The Super Mario. It's a Konami game. It's a run. And they you run. Is they it made like, a, they what, made, is it like Temple Run or whatever. It's but sideways? it's basically new Super Mario Brothers, but Mario keeps running. Hook. So you just. Hug for Super Nintendo. Oh my god. Put it on my list. Magical Quest starring Mickey Mouse. Oh my gosh. Hook. Hook? I love that game. Oh man. I'd hook for Sega Genesis. The Lion King game for yep. the Super Nintendo. Oh my gosh. Aladdin. You guys remember Aladdin? This Aladdin. shit was hard. <laughs> Which shit one? Was hard. Remember the, the Super Nintendo one and the Genesis one were so different. Oh, well, I had the Super Nintendo one. All the was, Super Nintendo games are stupid hard. It was I know. Like so hard. You go back and play it, it's like, this is harder than. This is so it hard. It had a Battletoads thing in it. With Battletoads the, was hard. No, like, remember, remember the ba- one mission Battletoads? On Battletoads where you fly yeah. around the Yeah, you were on the Magic Aladdin, Carpet. Aladdin had the same Aladdin. mission, but you were on a Magic Carpet and you had to guess. was chasing you. Yeah. Yeah, it was scary. Sucked. That was good. Oh. Samurai Showdown. Ah, oh. like man. All right, favorite Super Nintendo games coming on a different podcast. I can't put Skyrim on that. No, Super Mario RPG. Super Skyrim. Super Mario RPG. Fantastic game. Yeah, it's true. That's got to be like number one for it's everyone. True. I think. No. Oh, Chrono Trigger. That's... Uh, Secrets of Mana. Oh yeah. Well, never mind. I still think Hook could be number one. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Ah. Uh. 